Hello, it's Ricardo and welcome back to Elite Dangerous Odyssey. Well, here I am at a Wells class carrier. It just so happens there's a community goal happening at the moment, which had you bring in stuff to a Wells class carrier in regards to you know certain items. Anyway, just so happened I was knocking about there and doing some cargo runs. And then, as we all know, update eight dropped, which now brought interiors, allowing you to come in and walk around the concourse of said mega ship. Let's take a look. So for those of us who have a PC and have Elite Dangerous Odyssey, we are now no strangers to the interior of stations. But when they announced with the patch notes for update eight, a couple of weeks back that we were gonna be seeing the inside of certain megaships and Wells class megaships at that and being able to walk around the concourse I was thinking well how's that gonna go really what's it gonna look like is it gonna be as swish as how they've made the stations well to be perfectly honest with you I was pleasantly surprised as I mentioned at the beginning of this video I happened to find myself close to a Wells class carrier doing the current community goal and with that I thought I'd go and take a good look inside the said ship. Now the Wells class carriers are those that allow you to get in there and dock because you can't really walk around unless you can dock. This does pose a question however of all the other mega ships that are out there and when are we going to get to walk around those but hey let's not cramp FDev style. Here I am at the Pride of Bitterwood the particular Wells class carrier or mega ship if you want to call it and I'm disembarking out of my crate mark two and here I am stood on the landing pad. Now in this particular ship I've got to go towards the rear of the ship to get to the elevators that are going to take me up to the concourse level. This is no stranger to us we've been doing this for months in regards to Odyssey when on a station so it's a comparable experience. You approach the lift, you press the button, and away you go. Now these mega ships and the social spaces have been added at the moment to Wells class mega ships. These social spaces will include um, the following services: Inter Astra. Then you've got Apex Interstellar, Vista Genomics, and as soon as you walk through. I get that feeling of being inside a service station. I don't know what it is. I think it is this lower level, okay? Once you get through the Stargate sort of arc as you walk in, you've got a couple of panels. Now that's where you normally find the arcades in a service station in the UK and then straight through and you can see all sort of the CD bars and restaurants and that sort of stuff that you normally get to see on your way to the toilet. Anyway, here we are in the bar area. Hardly 10 forward from Star Trek, but you know, I think it's functional. Out the windows, you get a great view of the spinning wheels and the habitat rings and, you know, the agricultural domes that are there as well. There are tables dotted around. There are vacant tables and trays that haven't been cleaned up in regards to this mega ship. And again, lovely views out those windows. Hey, so far so good. And it's a good hubbub of noise. This was a bit strange. Why have a hob? in the middle of a communal area like this. You know, a social area. You expected to cook your own pot noodle on there or something? I don't know. Uh, just seemed a little bit out of place. I mean, the drinks dispensers, I get it. You know, who doesn't need a soda stream every now and again? But I, I get that, that's fine. A microwave perhaps, but you know, an electric hob. Well, we got these in our houses. Again, more booths everywhere. And of course you've got the bar section. Moving up these stairs, right, we get to this much famous escape pod area and I'll get to those at the end of the video. These escape pods are available at the mega ships to cover any rare situations whereby players might find themselves trapped on a mega ship and unable to get back to their own ship. I suppose if there's not um, a taxi service you could get stuck for some reason or you could just jump into a taxi we've got pioneer supplies in regards to this we've also got Vista genomics pioneer supplies like I mentioned a bartender frontline solutions so yeah 
quite good. You know, and it was an easy addition. I think it was a quick win to put in. Um, a lot of the artifacts have been reused in regards to this, as you would imagine, but that all lends itself to a continuous universe. You know, something that we're familiar with. There's, there's no reason to suggest that a module like Apex Interstellar, for example, would be any different here on a mega ship as it would be on a station or an outpost. A few graphical updates as well when you look through that door, you know, what's behind the desk, what's going on there, what's in his little room, and of course you've got the familiar lifts for Apex Interstellar as well. Now, this ship, it's parked in a war zone at the moment, so I was quite surprised that there wasn't any frontline solutions here. But hey, you can't have everything, and it stands to have a good look around this concourse level of the Wells class mega ship. So, as I promised, time to go and have a look now at these escape pods and what happens. So, managed to get myself all sorted out. I've had a good look round. Time to get myself up to the escape pod. So, with that, up the stairs we go. Without crashing into too many things in third person. I am terrible at this. I really am. And here is the escape pod. Well, isn't that wonderful? Look at that. So what do you do with it? So it does give you a nice little warning when you approach the escape pod. Now, we haven't seen escape pods in Elite Dangerous since the original games, which is great, you know? Start escape. You will leave the station. I pressed it, the screen went blank, and it popped me out as a server crash. Hey, that probably could be just down to the fact it's new. So I've been Ricardo. Thanks very much for watching. It's been a brief look around the concourse and social space on the Wells Cast Carrier mega ships. Hope you found it interesting. I certainly have. Thanks very much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already done so, and I'll see you soon.